Hey everyone, it's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're just joining us now, welcome! I feel really bizarre doing this video standing up. I'm not the type of person to do videos, especially not hauls, standing up. But I thought I would change it up a little bit and stand up. Love mixing up the content. Anyway, I am standing up for this video purely because I want this to be more of like a show you the item, try it on, talk about it when it's on type of video. I watched one of my friends, Megan, do a haul the other day, Megan Shaw. It was really like fast paced, she got straight to the point and I liked the video a lot. So I thought I'm going to try doing one like that. We're gonna try that. Yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. Now, I haven't did a Sheen haul in the longest time. Like, I feel like it's been well over a year since I did a Sheen haul. No reason why, because I absolutely... <laughs> no reason... <laughs> no reason why, because I absolutely love Sheen. I just haven't did one in a very long time. So, for today's video, we are gonna be doing a Sheen haul. I'm very, very excited because I do love Sheen and I feel like you can get some amazing things there. Like, I have got... I would say 10 staple items in my wardrobe that I wear all of the time that are amazing from Shein. So I definitely feel like you can get some amazing things there. Saying that though, they can be hit or miss. That's why I always think these haul videos are fun because you could get a really good item, a really good banging haul, or you could get a really flop haul. Um, because I feel like sometimes size isn't great, sometimes quality isn't great. But I do want to do another video, so that's what we're going to be doing. I'm just chilling in my dressing gown right now. What do you call these? A dressing gown or a house coat? Because I seen on Twitter the other day that people actually call these house coats. And I'm sorry, but like, it, that's not normal. This is a dressing gown. So what do you call them anyway yeah we are just going to get straight into the sheen haul i really hope that you enjoyed this video if you enjoy my hauls please give it a thumbs up subscribe down below and without further ado, -ta -ta, let's just get into the video i've been watching too much saffron i feel like when i watch a lot of a certain youtuber i pick up little things that they do and i adapt it into my own video and i've been watching a lot of saffron's video recently and she does this really cool like let's get into the video thing and i feel like i'm I'm picking it up sorry saffron i'm not i'm not stealing your brand got a lot of tops i don't know why there was a lot of tops that i just really like the look of the first one i got is this gorgeous silk material um type of top in a leopard print now i really really love the style of this now i got everything in a 2xl it's the size that i tend to get when i shop on likes of sheen or zaffel and things like that and i do feel it is equivalent to a uk 18 but i'm not 100 percent sure um but this is the top that i got i really like this now i wear a lot of dresses in this style and i underlay them so i had the same idea with this top if i underlayer it with like a long sleeve high neck tuck it into some jeans i think it would be like a really nice casual meal drinks outfit to go with that i decided to pick up this high neck black top so this is a um high neck but it's got this super super cute little frill on it and it also has the frill at the bottom and then um it doesn't have it at the bottom but yeah so this is just a really basic high neck long sleeve top but like i said i do a lot of layering and outfits at the minute especially like that little top that i previously showed you so this is the type of item that is just a staple for me because a layer outfit I pretty much every outfit i wear these days is a layering type of outfit which means i need a lot of these <laughs> Um, so yeah I'm really excited to have this one and I thought the little extra detailing on it was so so cute these are the only pair of pants that I got and then I'm just going to keep these on while I try the rest of the stuff on but I got some black mum style jeans again they've kind of got that lettuce hem frill at the top and then they've got this um, zip here with this little gold buckle they have um, a part for a belt which is mint because I hate it when pants don't have a section for a belt because it's very rare that I wouldn't wear a belt um but yeah they're like a really kind of they're like a dark black but they have got a kind of a washed out look to them as well but I really like them they are a mum style jean and I think they're so pretty now I don't have a belt with us which is really annoying us because I feel like they're not going to look that great without a belt but let's just try that first full little outfit on but yeah I don't know how well you can see but I actually really like the jeans I just feel they're a slight bit too big which like I never see, usually things are too small on us, but I definitely could have sized down in these because there's a lot of room, but I think once I get a belt on, they'll be absolutely fine. 
but um yeah i really like this first little outfit this is the um little high neck top underneath i think it's dead cute now this doesn't sit as nice as i thought it would to be honest it's a little bit baggy i'm not really sure what i expected because it is like meant to be a baggy top i think or it is meant to like i don't know i just don't think it looks how i intended it to look i don't know if it's the cut of the top being more square that it doesn't give us the look that i was kind of thinking it would i don't know it just doesn't it doesn't you know when you have like a visual image or something and then you try it on and it doesn't give you that image i'm kind of like feeling that about this top like it's not really giving us the the visuals that i had but i'm not mad at it and i definitely feel like i could maybe trail around with it and style it in a way that i would like but yeah it's just not 100 percent kind of what i'd expected it to be excited about so this is a black little top it's got a high neck on it as well i like things with a high neck i don't know why because they're not the most flattering on it's like they definitely make us look like a potato let's be real but i do like a high neck and i always go for high necks and um, but this is just a plain black top in the middle but the arms of this are stunning they're balloon arms balloon they're balloon arms but they're mesh so they've got like a mesh bit and i love this because i like my arms being covered but if i can have them covered and still showing i feel like that's kind of a little bit of a sexy vibe and it's something that i'm there for so i'm very excited about this and i'm very excited to try it on oh my god i adore this look at how bloody stunning this fit is like the arms look so pretty i definitely feel like this is a really cute meal and drinks which i want to be doing a hell of a lot of when we get out of this lockdown so i'm really excited about this and i feel like it's not an item that'll go like out of fashion i know lace kind of goes in and out of fashion but it's not really like too lace um i'm really impressed with this top actually i really like it i think it like flat as is and i like the style of it i just think it's like really elegant looking as well and i think it looks a hell of a lot more expensive than like sheen prices i think this was literally like seven pounds so mega mega cheap but i'm very excited about this the next item i got i absolutely love a graphic tee like i have a few vintage ones that are like staples in my wardrobe by like the harley davidson style and stuff and i've seen this on sheen and it really reminded us of like one of the vintage graphic tees that i love as you can see it's just like got this gorgeous like pattern on it and it just says cruising burger city and it's like american vibes i don't know what it is but i was very very attracted to this so i thought i'm gonna put it in the basket it's definitely oversized it is huge but i actually really like that um i really love the style of this i love 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 the design on it now this um is the t-shirt i would wear this with like a high neck top um if i was going out like if i was lounging around in it i would just wear it as a t-shirt but if i wanted to make it like a proper outfit i think a high neck top with some mum jeans could look like so so stylish but i think this is so cute and i love the pattern of it and the quality of the material is great as well because i hate t-shirt quality that's really stiff like tell us if you've had a stiff t-shirt before because i've had stiff t-shirts and i hate them but this is that like soft kind of cotton material which i personally personally love but i really love the style of this i think it is so so pretty and definitely something that is going to be a staple in my wardrobe the next thing that i have is another i would kind of say meal and drinks tops i definitely had the meal and drinks vibes in my head when i did this order but as you can see it is quite a see-through mesh top with this silver sparkle deal all over it now i think this is so pretty again it has got a high neck but it's not very thick it's like a funnel neck um but it's got like these little stars printed all over and I just thought it was the prettiest thing. Now I don't have a little black top with us to try this on with because I wouldn't wear it like that. Um, I do have a black bra on though so I am still going to try it on um, just because you know I'm not bothered about that type of thing. It is see through but like I said I would wear it with something underneath. But the style of this top stunning i love the arms on it and i think it's such a gorgeous fit like it's not dead dead tight i can wiggle i can move i can do me stuff in it but it is like you know tight enough to kind of figure huggers i really love the style of this even with these like black jeans and some little heels and a belt would be so so cute but yeah i'm not mad at this at all i really like it and i think once you've got a little top underneath it it could look so so flattering and classy get a bit of red lip on off your trot there you go yeah sorted hun i got is another t-shirt 
God, I went t-shirt wild. But I just think she can do the best t-shirts, the nicest t-shirts. But this one's so, so cute. Um, So this is long-armed. Again, I really like long-arm stuff because my arms are not like my favourite part. Especially this part. I just think it's rather chubby. Um, But yeah, this is really cute. It's got this like gorgeous kind of like speckled pattern on it. And it's got a v-neck. And it does come down into kind of a little bit of a peplum. But I would probably tuck it in anyway. Or if I don't tuck it in, I would probably tuck the peplum bit up to make it look like a cropped top but I really like this it does have peplum arms which I really like but I really love the style of this I think they had it in red as well and if this fits nice I'm really tempted to get the red version peplum bit under just because I feel like a little bit of skin does look more flattering like it's just the vibe that I like so I have tucked that under but with that being under I love 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 this top I love like the arms on it how you've got the little peplum arms and then I love the style of it around the chest area and stuff and I just think it looks really nice and again a lot more expensive than this I think this was literally five pounds so it was mega mega cheap but I really really like it I mean you can obviously wear it with the peplum bit if you're not a fan of cropped but if you do like cropped then I think this is such a cute way to wear it. Going out on holiday for a meal and stuff with some little shorts I think is so, so cute. But yeah, I really love this top and I'm definitely going to get the red version of it because how cute is this, man? It looks so flattering. Don't tell us otherwise. Do not burst this bubble, okay? Because I will be devastated. I like it and that's all that matters, okay? <laughs> I've got this really, like, thing about leaves and I keep dreaming about, like, tropical-themed interior design rooms. That's, like, my literal goals at the minute. Um, and I've seen this bikini or bathing that or swimsuit whatever you want to call it and I really wanted it so this is the top off of it you've just got like the boob area and then it comes down into this really cute little bikini style top now you do have a peephole now having a bigger chest this could go either way for me it could look really flattering or it could just like hell to the nose so I'm not really sure how this is gonna look but I really love the style of it okay, so this is the bikini now I'm not mad of it I just wish it had a little bit more support around the boob area because I don't feel like I'm the most supported around here like I would go out in this still but I do like my boobs to look a little bit more perky considering they're not that perky I expect that support from the bear that and unfortunately this one just isn't giving us as much as I would like um and I have pulled it right up as well and it just like I think the boobs are just pulling it down a bit too much this was my sheen haul I really hope that you enjoyed this video let us know what your best item is below if there's anything you love anything you think hell to the row honey I would not wear that if I was you let us know I'm always up for your comments and if you've got any other video suggestions that you want us to do let us know in the comments below but without further ta -ta -ta, I'll let you go and I'll see you very shortly for another video bye Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, bing, bang, wanna, wanna, bing, bang, ooh,